In this video, we're going to look at subtracting a four-digit number from a five-digit number using column subtraction. We're going to look to solve the equation 74,086 subtract 6,245. The first step in solving this equation is to write our larger number on top of our smaller number. It's crucially important at this point that you write all the ones in the ones column, all the tens in the tens, the hundreds in the hundreds, thousands in thousands, and ten thousands in the ten thousands. If you were to write out your equation like this, you are going to get the incorrect answer because you've put your six thousands in the ten thousand column, your two hundreds in the thousand column. You need to make sure that you put all your thousands underneath each other, all your hundreds underneath each other, your tens underneath each other, and finally your ones underneath each other. You then write the subtraction sign and draw a line under your two numbers. Before you start solving, it's important that you check the two numbers that you've written down and check they're the same as in the question. Here, 6,245, I'm happy. 74,086, I'm happy. I'm also subtracting. This is a real common error where children will add here instead of subtracting or if it was in the addition up here, in the actual equation, in the question, they may subtract. I'm happy we're subtracting. You always start off by subtracting on the far right hand side first, your ones. Six subtract five is one. Now we move on to the tens. Eight subtract four is four. Zero subtract two. I can't do that. If I've got no hundreds, I can't take two hundreds away from no hundreds. This we often call a, a red alert and means I need to find some extra hundreds somewhere. I can find these extra hundreds by exchanging 1000 for 10 hundreds. So I exchange one of the four thousands that makes we end, uh, means we end up with 3,000 for 10 hundreds. And I add these 10 hundreds to my zero to make 10. Now I can do 10 subtract 2. That makes 8 hundreds. 3 subtract 6. I can't do that again. You've got a red alert. So I'm going to exchange one of my 10 thousands for 10 one thousands. Instead of 7 thousands. Seven ten thousands, I now have six ten thousands. Instead of three thousands, I have thirteen thousands. Thirteen subtract six is seven, and finally six subtract zero is six. Our answer then is sixty seven thousand eight hundred and forty one. 